this idea that the tropics will be sort of what's now would be considered record heat almost every year, and that there's no other way to cool the earth than these solar geoengineering things, I think uh, gives at least the possibility that there could be intense political pressure to, uh, to deploy these things. Let me just say something about social acceptability. I heard somebody talking about different particles that could be put in the sky to uh, try to reflect sunlight. And somebody said, so there's, you know, that one, one of the um, forms might be some kind of carbon in the form of a diamond. Uh, you know, but you know, sort of point, I don't know what is point one micron, little tiny things. And you know, people think, okay, people will never put up with this. But you know, if, uh, you know, the, the American population put up with uh, kidnapping and torture, through the extraordinary rendition program, the you know with surveillance of all our tele telecommunication and our our uh, movement, and when it was announced post facto, most Americans were fine with it. And you know, I think if a political leader announced, "Oh, we started putting diamonds in the sky to protect you," I you know I think if they put if if they put up with kidnapping and torture, they will likely put up with diamonds in the sky. So I think this idea that people are not going to accept these things is uh, maybe overly optimistic.